Hi, welcome to Amster. Today I'll be viewing this Foxwell wireless endoscope. And let me show some of the pages from the user manual. If you want to read any part in more detail, just feel free to pause the video. Now this endoscope does work with both Android and iOS devices. The app is free. One of the first things I want to point out is the wireless password is just one through eight in case anyone ever loses it. And this one also supports a higher resolution besides 720 which a lot of the others do. This one is, they say this also supports a 1080p or 1080. Here are the instructions on how to search for the wireless app. It's called HD Wi-Fi in iOS or the Google Play Store. And some other instructions here. The app is very straightforward. I'll demonstrate that too. Now, besides the camera, it also came with a couple of accessories. All the accessories are actually packed nice and neat in here. Let's pull off the cap. We have a magnet accessory. We got a right angle mirror. And then a hook. Now these accessories are smaller than the other ones I reviewed in the past. There's not really no con to that. It's easier, it's not as fragile as the other ones. But to put these accessories on, this tip over here, just gotta unscrew this. And so for example, if I want the 90 degree view, essentially the 45 degree mirror, screw this one on. So for example, if I want to leave in this position, I can. Position this way, I can. A lot of the ones I had in the past, it just droops down. Whereas this one, the cable itself, it's much thicker. I can, it's more, I can adjust to however angle I want. To turn it on, just let me flip the switch, turns it on. You can see that the camera it's already turned up there. It takes about 30 seconds for it to boot up. Now it's fully booted. A couple buttons. Basically zoom out, zoom in, take a little snapshot. And over here, this little dial is how I adjust the brightness of the light. I'm just going to take this piece off here. That way we can see the LEDs. There's six of them. Let me first show you how I connect the Wi-Fi. So head to the settings and head to the Wi-Fi and it's called Jetion right over here. The password as I showed before is just numbers one through eight. Give a sec. Now it's connected. And let me head back to HD Wi-Fi. Oh hello. Let me show off the menu system here for a sec settings page here I can change the resolution lowest is 640 by 480 highest is 1080 the phone I'm using here this is the iPhone XS Max I change the SSID name change the wireless password if I want to but if I change like any of the resolutions if I set to 1080 for example just press the set resolution set it back here. This is waterproof so I can use this under the sink, check the pipes, help snake things out. Um, for example if I drop something in the sink I use the hook. To, if I drop the ring for example I use the hook, get it back out. Now for troubleshooting purposes using the smartphone app I can also take snapshots, record a video if I want to, and yeah, this is more of a troubleshooting tool. The frame rate is about 15 frames per second, so it's not going to replace any of my other cameras. It's not going to be replace my Sony camera. It's not going to replace my iPhone camera. This is specifically for DIY projects, troubleshooting. If I want to do any sort of uh, duck work, if I want to just snake through the duck, see what's going on. And if it gets too dark, well, I'm just adjust this little die over here to make it brighter much brighter. Like I mentioned, works with both iOS and Android. 
very easy to use app, straightforward. Now, it cost about $37 off Amazon. There was a 20% off code. I'll place that link in the description below. Overall, I like this and I recommend it. Well, thanks for watching this video. If you guys have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to contact me. Thanks for watching my hamster. Bye.